In this video, I want to share with you seven tips to start promoting your music online right now. So let's dive in. Tip number one, upload your music to YouTube. YouTube is a great platform to start uploading your music because it is free and it will give you the option to interact with your possible fans. You can upload a song and if you don't have any visuals, just use the album cover and you're good to go. Upload a full album, make a playlist out of it and you have something to share online. It's a great platform to start on and even with the basic settings on YouTube, you can get a lot of new fans and subscribers to your music. Number two is going to be SoundCloud. Some with the same as YouTube in terms of it's free and you can upload your music there, but it's different in terms of you can only upload your music there. It's only used for sound. So you don't have any visuals and you don't have that much possibilities to interact with your fans. But that doesn't mean that it is not possible. You can interact with them through DMs and to comments, but it's also free and it's probably one of the best platforms that you can use in combination with any other online music promotion strategy. And tip number three, I want you to upload all your song to iTunes and Spotify. You can do that for free by using a service called Rap note and if you want to have more information about that there's a link in the description and you will learn how to upload your music to route note and share it on all the spotify itunes and similar streaming platforms it's free and it's a great way to get your first song on spotify and increase your professionality a little bit if your song is high quality enough that's really important tip number four create an electronic press kit an electronic press kit will be your portfolio. It's a bundled up version of who you are as an artist. It's your business card, basically. So if you want to connect with a &R managers or maybe labels or just people that hopefully promote your music, an electronic press kit can really help to present yourself as an artist, make it as awesome as possible and as professional as possible, and you're good to go. Tip number five is going to be create a website. Now this is the first tip that might cost you some money, but it doesn't have to be super expensive. You can go for free sometimes even. If you have a website, you can direct people to your website and it will be an extension of the electronic press kit of some sort. You will have more options to share your own music and to share some backstage videos or some stories that you have, but also to keep your audience updated in the best way possible. Tip number six is going to be start using social media in the best way possible. Now, I said this many times in other videos, don't over promote yourself, but also don't under promote. Don't wait until something happens. Try to reach out in music groups, in singer songwriters groups. Just simply talk about your music like you would do in regular life not on social media. So you don't go to a party and instantly start selling your album to everybody that is there. You can post your song once or twice a week, but keep talking about other stuff that is also relevant to you, but also to your possible fan. Try to find out what they like to read about or what, what they like to hear about and start posting that as well, alongside your music and your story. Try to mix and match, and usually an 80-20 rule is best, like 80% of other people's stuff and just 20% of yours stuff. Try it out and see how it works. I will assure you that you will get great results if you do it the right way. And tip number seven is the mailing list. A mailing list is powerful because the people that are on that list will be yours, so to speak. They agreed to be on the list because they like your music and they interacted with it. If you share one of your songs for free and in return they just have to give their email address, that can be a great way to find out if people actually like your song. If they stay on the mailing list, they probably like your song. So once your album is out, you can mail the update to the mailing list and there's a high chance that they will buy the album. A mailing list is probably going to be the most powerful thing in your whole online marketing strategy. There's a lot more to it and it's way too much for this video so I'm gonna end it here and if you want more tips like these don't forget to subscribe and like and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.